off, son. We focus on work. And when you're home, you help your grandmother, brother, and sister. I like her, Mom. Like her? But break it off till this pandemic is over. What's going to happen then? Well, you can quit your job then and go get with her if that's more important to you. I can do both. Let me get this through your thick skull. You don't piss where you drink. It's shit where you eat. Yeah, well, I'm at work. Well, I'm at home. You know there will not be any school this semester, this coming fall. So I need you to be home teaching Sean and Toya. That's it. They need you. Right. And I'm living here till this is over. Well, Dad's been calling. He wants to help at their school. You let him into our house? Grandma don't mind. Berman is way into my life. Berman? He's not some parasite. He's my dad. I know. But could somebody please try to make my life easier? Mm, two new men. <laughs> now that's what I call a good day. Reporting for duty. Oh, Mr. Jackson, you made good on your PT and OT. Nice. It's my second hit replacement rodeo. Well, we'll keep you moving. And we'll get you back on the horse. <laughs> We're glad you're here. <laughs> I had no other choice. No one wants to move into a nursing home now. We're extra careful here. They moved me over from memory care. We're not bringing in outside staff, and none of our people are working second jobs at another facility. I'm just happy to be alive. And we're happy you're here. Oh, my God. Okay, I'll be right over. No, you will let me in. M Mrs. Klein? She's barely breathing. Oh, go. I'm sorry about her wife. You know her? She was one of my favorite African dance teachers. Small world. And I subbed for Judy's English class at the high school when they got married. October 6th, 2014. Now, how did you know that? Well, they were all over the papers. It was the first day of marriage equality. Oh, hmm. oh I, I want to introduce Dante. He does everything around here. We go way back. He moved me in yesterday. Dante? Dante's Inferno? Didn't he go to, to the underground place? Well, Dante's the author. It's not about him. Mom, Dante's the author and the main character. That's right. He went to hell, purgatory, and heaven to see God again. It's a fine name. My dad picked it. He's into stuff. Your name's historic, too. Yep. Andrew Jackson, uh, Stonewall Jackson. Uh, Jesse Jackson, Michael Jackson, Mahalia Jackson. Jackson Brown? Who's that? The Pretender. Late for the sky. Run it on empty. <laughs> Can't talk. Oh, just zoom in. I, I'll, uh, I'll put you in a waiting room. In 69, I was 21, and I called the road my own. I don't know when the road turned into the road I'm on. I'm on. You were 21 in 69. You got a new nurse already? I, you're in the waiting room. I'm taking responsibility for myself. That's why I'm in treatment. They don't respond. It's a trauma response. I'm the COVID. I'm the unemployment. I'm the police brutality. I'm the greed. It's all in me. Don't engage. I'm the disease. And I'm the cure. Here's the cure. 
Grandpa, she said no. What's it going to take to change your mind? Why did you wait for Andrea to talk to me about this? I didn't want to get you mad. <laughs> Let's slow down, Grandpa. What's the hurry? If she's going to collect my Social Security, we need to be married for eight months. I don't want your Social Security. I, I want you to have it. If I could buy this place straight out. I don't need your money. I didn't know that. Did you ask? You could have a prenup. What about your daughter? Kitty, we don't talk. <laughs> Name. Kitty is Catherine, but with a C. Oh. She's mad at you. She's mad about everything. Now it's the masks. She pulled mine off before I was going out. Yeah. Clean up your mess before we get married. Is, is that what you want? That's right. Oh, and a smoke and a haircut. Give me that. that that's, that's mine. Now don't start with that again. Betty, what else? You proposed to me in front of everyone. Grandpa? On Zoom. You proposed on Zoom. Give me that. Do you want me to get you your own? I want you to be my wife. I don't want to lose you. You're not going to lose me. <laughs> your grandfather. What do you want to do, Betty? Well, if we get married, and I said if, we want you to marry us. That's right, if we get married. Me? We'll take care of the legal down at the courthouse. You do the rest. You're our family. You love birds. No, you run the service, I'll organize it. <laughs> if? Okay, old man, let's do this. I thought it would be a cold day in hell before you called me. This is important. I'll tell you what's important. I just quit smoking and drinking. Why did you quit this time? This time? Oh, I just need all the air I can get. And I don't want this damn virus to kill me. Well, that's good. I called to say I'm sorry. For what? Well, for not coming to see you in the hospital, for cutting you off. Why don't we just leave well enough alone? I don't have a dad, and you don't have a daughter. Spoken like a judge's daughter. <laughs> I'm three days clean. And you're apologizing. <laughs> Kitty, I'm getting married. I want you to be there. Well, I'm not going to be your best man. No, I'm going to ask Uncle Dennis. Oh. <laughs> there are no bats in that belfry. <laughs> what? Good choice, Judge. This is going better than I thought. Good for you. The rehearsal dinner is tonight. And the wedding is Saturday. I'm not leaving this house. And I am not wearing a mask for no one. Catherine, it's a Zoom wedding and a Zoom rehearsal dinner. I really want you to be there. Please? Well, how many more times will I get a chance to see my dad get married? To you, Judge. To the Judge. <laughs> oh, my feet are killing me. Uh, uh, <clears throat> Nothing. This is my brother, Dennis. He's my best man. He doesn't talk much anymore. Hello, Dennis. I'm John. I'm the new guy. I know Dennis from the memory place downstairs. Innovations? I don't know what they're innovating, but yeah. He's never been on Zoom before. Betty called a nurse to set it up for him. OK, who's on first?
Dennis, you have your mute on. Who's on first? What's on second? I don't know who's on third. <laughs> what got you interested in marriage, Judge? What's on second? Who's on first? <laughs> what are you waiting for? Godot. <laughs> Not Godot. <laughs> I love her. That's why we're getting married. Godot. <laughs> Dennis. Godot, Godot. Good job. I have the time, but I didn't read the book. Sorry. That's all right. I'm not going to read a book on wife fragility. You got your hair cut. Bonnie came by. She had on so much PPE, she had her picture on her chest. I'm getting married, and I can't get my hair done? I'm glad you came around. Me too. Yeah, I like, uh, what's his name, uh, Mr. Jackson. I like his hair. I knew you'd go there. He goes by John. He's very quiet. I call him the philosopher. Aren't you curious that I changed my mind? I know you love him. And it's nice to share our time with someone. I miss Gwen, so I understand. I like how you take care of the judge. And now you have the legal right to help him if he needs it. Well, it wasn't an easy decision. You made the right choice. Mr. Jackson's got nice eyes. Did you see how he was looking at you? Oh, please. You can't tell who people are looking at on Zoom. Liza, do you like him? I think we should be talking about a book and not John. You called him John. You do like him. Oh, <laughs> I think we're all going to die suddenly. We've been stuck in our rooms too long. Mr. Jackson's had a hip replacement. He was an English teacher. Don't be setting me up. I understand, Liza. We're not trying to rush you into anything. Oh, honey, that's your problem and not mine. And he says, who let the dogs out? And I said, you let the dogs out. I was wearing pants. It went down. You're legging out your pants. No, I don't. <clears throat> Can we start? This is a rehearsal dinner. I didn't know we started. You didn't return my text. I was busy. Yeah, the dogs got out. I told you we should elope. <laughs> this is my granddaughter, Andrea. She's marrying us. Hi. My best man, my brother, Dennis. I know Dennis. Dennis I, I came over from memory care. Big heart. Uncle Dennis! Russ! <laughs> Russ, 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 Russ! Good to see you too, Uncle Dennis. That's my daughter, Kitty. Catherine, with a C. Thanks for being here, Catherine. It means a lot to me and the judge and Andrea. Oh, and there's my baby sister, Mona. You look happy, sis. Why you want to ruin that with marriage? <laughs> Trigger alert. Trigger alert. Please put that cigarette out. For my dead body. Enjoy it for me. I am. We're here for my grandpa and my bonus grandma. I like everyone to say one romantic thing to them. Oh, okay. Here we go. Smile though your heart is breaking. Smile even though it's aching. When there are clouds in the sky, you'll get by. <laughs> oh, Dennis? <laughs> zoom. <laughs> zoom! 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 Oh, I gotta 
song for you, Judge. If you don't make my sister number one, the number two on you. Mm, she let the dogs out. Andrea? Yes? I'm in love with you. Dante! Mom talking, Andrea. Young man, I didn't hear anyone ask my permission. Why does, why does anyone need you? Who are you? He doesn't have my permission. Come on, people, it's 2020. Look, that's all I'm going to say. We're all going to die. Who's next? Ah, I wish you laughter <clears throat> and a gentle touch. Squeeze her, but not too tight. I lie for you, and I'll cry for you, and I'd lay my body down and die for you. If that isn't love, well, it will have to do. Till the real thing comes along. And stay away from that damn COVID. Dr. Klein, glad you could make it. Are you okay? To my sister and new brother. I love you, big sis. Andrew? You first. <sighs> We shall not cease from exploration and end of all our exploring. We'll be to arrive where we started and know the place for the first time. P.S. Elliot. Andrew? Grandpa, Betty, logic gives you what you want, but magic gives you what you need. Oh. All right. And Betty. Woohoo! <laughs> In here. Adjourn. Yeah. Wait, Mom, you didn't say anything romantic. Uh, for me, the most romantic line is Till death do you part. Mm. Till death do you part. She's dead. My wife. Judy died. 